episode of Bitchin' Kitchen is all about deflating your mate. See, whenever you're cooking a low-fat meal, you want to use big flavors to make up for the lack of greasy goodness. Olives, capers, garlic. We're going to whip up our wasabi smashed potatoes and sear this gorgeous tuna steak. As an Italian, I'm completely food obsessed. When I'm eating a good meal, I'm usually thinking about another good meal I've eaten. I plan vacations around restaurants. My Bible is the Zagat. And if you were to ask me whether I'd rather make out with Clooney or scoff a creamy truffled mushroom risotto, man, I'd make out with Clooney. This episode is dedicated to the Last Supper. That's right, the breakup meal. I'm talking about the last meal you'll ever make for that no longer special someone. Who can cause a scene when they're presented with a designer burger? Vegans, maybe. I especially love this dessert because my dad used to eat this all the time. But instead of port, he would use homemade red wine. And there were no peaches. This episode of Bitchin' Kitchen is all about being broke. So today, we're gonna make a meal that tastes as good as it is cheap. A melt-in-your-mouth beef and sweet roasted root veggie stew. But some people will call this eating your emotions. What else are you supposed to do with emotions? Stay hungry. What was that? That was weird, no? What?